Sefo, could you just talk about uh, what you see in the USC defense as you prepare for this week's game? Yeah, so, so far we've seen uh, kind of two main things that they run. Uh, you know, nothing crazy, nothing we haven't seen this year. I think we have a lot of good things dialed up for them this week, and, you know, we just have to go out there and execute and, and beat the man in front of us. Uh, what's your impression of their defensive personnel? Uh, they're really good up front. You know, they don't play a lot of guys, but, you know, the guys that do play um, are, are good playmakers. And, you know, everyone on defense in the Pac-12 are playmakers, um, but, you know, especially their, their front seven, uh, they're, they're really good. You know, not to you know, say that their defensive backs are, are bad or anything, but, you know, their front sevens are uh, pretty good. Sefo, in short yard situations, you guys had struggled offensively, but it seemed like you kind of broke through in the second half against Oregon State. Did you kind of figure it out in that sense going forward? Uh, does the offense feel like that? Yeah, yeah, definitely. You know, obviously, uh, we've had our ups and downs this year and last year uh, in short yardage situations. But you know, I think we're I think we're figuring out and and figuring out uh, you know kind of what we're gonna run uh, in those kind of situations. And you know, it's just a matter of executing. And I think we're we're getting there. Seppo, you guys are averaging uh, roughly a hundred yards more a game this year than than last year. Obviously, scoring more points, being more competitive as an offense. What has gone into that? Uh, increase in production and, and that sort of thing. You know, it just comes in and being the off being like inside of the offense, you know, another year and everyone being more familiar with the system and everyone's executing a lot more and, and knowing their roles and just being able to execute. <clears throat> We're not doing anything new, or anything different. Uh, it just it just comes down to executing and playing together on a consistent basis and that's what the offense is doing this year. <clears throat> Sefo, Leonard Williams is an All-American candidate for a USC a defensive end. As a quarterback, can you kind of keep an eye out for us, a guy that's, you know, that touted, or can you just not worry about that and hope that, uh, you know, everybody's just doing their job? Uh, you know, I just expect everyone to do their job. You know, obviously he's a good player, and you have to respect that, but, you know, we're not going to give him any special attention. I mean, their whole defense is solid and, you know, can all be All-Americans. So, you know, we're not, we're not trying to focus on him. Coming out of the Oregon State game, there was obviously a big feeling of, dang, I wish we could get right back out there. You know, we don't want to have the bye week. Now that you've had the bye week, and uh, I guess you know, seeing what you can get out of that, are you happy that you had it this week? Uh, I don't know if you could say happy. I mean, there, there's there's pros and cons to bye weeks. I mean, everyone wanted to play, like you said, um, but you know, it was a good time for everyone to rest up, uh, kind of watch some film and, and catch up. Uh, you know, a lot of guys were, were dinged up, but you know, everyone's fresh and ready to go now. So you know, there's always pros and cons to it, but you know, looking on it, you know, it, it was good for us, and you know, we're ready to go for this week. Zepho, I know you don't lack for motivation to go out there and win every week. Uh, but CU has never beaten USC before. Is it at all a carrot dangling in front of this team or any kind of added motivation to be the first CU team that beats USC? No, there, there is no added motivation. You know, the motivation for us is to win every week. It doesn't matter who, who's put in front of us, you know, whether it's, you know, Oregon, SC, Alabama. You know, we just want to go one and know every week. And, and there is no extra added motivation. You know, we just want to win. Since you guys are playing in these games, you're becoming more and more competitive. Have you noticed a change in intensity in practice at all the last few weeks? No, I think overall, you know, ever since this new season started, I think there's been a great difference in terms of intensity at practice. You know, there's a lot more, um, you know, effort out there on, in the practice fields uh, compared to last year. Uh, guys are going harder, faster, and, and even for longer. Um, we're, we're just moving up uh, in an upwards direction uh, in terms of, you know, work ethic and competing. And uh, that's good to see. And, you know, we just have to be able to continue that through the rest of the season.